In today's project, we'll be taking this 486 full tower case, removing the components and making it into a rack for single board computers. The first step is to remove the base and open up the case. I'll speed that up a little bit here because removing screws is not that interesting. Once the screws have been removed, we can remove the motherboard and all the cards that are installed in the case. As you can see here, this is an Intel 486DX processor. That was all the rage back in the mid 90s. And the 30 pin SIM modules, that was probably quite a few hundred dollars worth of SIM back then. Next, we're gonna remove the five and a quarter inch and three and a half inch drives. The five and a quarter inch bays are what we're gonna be using to store the uh, components for the single board computers. As you can see, that drive there is only 212 megabytes. Next, we're removing the five and a quarter inch floppy drive. And we don't need this. This is for extra long cards as an extra support, but we won't be needing that. We might be able to use that space for something else. Stay tuned for the next step of this project coming soon. Thanks for watching. 